What's going on guys, Kaivox here, and welcome to the uh, review for Hagrid's Noble Collection Umbrella Wand. So I, I picked this guy up um, the end of the year, 2019, and then it took a couple months to get it in, and then uh, it's been sitting in the background for a while, and now I'm finally getting to it. If you guys don't know, Noble Collection makes a ton of, they make like all the replica wands, the ones that they have at Universal, like all that stuff, right? They make excellent wands. Now, they also made this. They make other props as well, other brands. They don't just do um, wands, but this is Hagrid's wand slash umbrella slash staff almost because it's a giant wand. It's kind of what a staff is. It's pretty much just a giant wand. I have some strong opinions about this. So if you want like, just like, the, oh my God, this is so cool, look at this. Like there are other channels out there, go check them out. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you guys and tell you exactly what I think. I'm always honest with you guys and I, uh, I'm sometimes brutally honest and you guys don't like it. So if you, if you don't like it, you can let me know down below how I'm just a jerk and I shouldn't whine so much. But there's a couple of problems with this thing. One, it's, it's decently expensive, you know, it's not 20, 30 bucks. Um, I think it's like 60, 59 or, 69, I'm not, I don't remember exactly how much it was, um, but it's not cheap, right? First thing you look at it, uh, one, yeah, it's an umbrella, okay. It's multi-purpose, you can cast spells and umbrella with it. The build quality is like, okay on it, all right? It's not that bad, it's not that bad, it's not that great. The umbrella part of it, it's not like a good umbrella. Like it is in the movie, It it is fairly small which is, uh, you know, it's to scale basically for the movie because he's big, so it looks really small in his hands. Um, but I don't know, it just seems like a, a fairly cheap wand. I mean, umbrella. Uh, it, it definitely feels lighter than the actual wands. I, I don't believe that this is um, solid plastic like the wands are where they're, they're just a solid piece of resin. Uh, and they have the metal cores, which makes them a little bit heavier. Maybe it is solid, but because it doesn't have the metal core, it feels very light and flimsy. Um, one thing I do love about it, which I'm I'm sure that they they didn't invent, um, but it's it's most likely a part of the original, is this um, buttoning mechanism, which I call it a mechanism, but it's really just a you know the the clasp for it. Um, it's a button with a little ring that you just, you know, clasp on there and it um, it holds it shut, which is super cute. And it, it's, a, it's a nice, just a good design for whoever designed the original wand. I keep saying wand, umbrella. Um, but one big thing, if you guys look at this, um, took it out of the box, was just instantly, can you tell that it's bent? Yeah, you should be able to tell that this right here, this is the, the point where it bends um, and it just seems it's because it seems like it's because the way that this fastens onto here it's not perfectly aligned so you can see that this side is higher than this side if you guys are going to buy this i want to make sure you know what you're getting into because this is not a, like it just buying like a 30 a 10 dollar or 20 dollar wand this is a um this is a big purchase so if you like hagrid and you want to have a cool wand umbrella leaning up against the back or something or on a shelf it's nice. I wouldn't recommend using this as a as a real umbrella because it's expensive and you could buy like a really nice umbrella for like 60 bucks, you know? I don't know, do they even sell umbrellas that are that expensive? Like what do you get with a $60 umbrella? It's an excellent question. So who is this for? Who would I recommend this to? The ultra mega Harry Potter fan slash Hagrid fan. If you love Hagrid, this is a must. If you're doing a cosplay or something, this is a must. You just buy a pink umbrella, nobody would even know. Maybe put some uh, gold tape on it or something um, and you're you know good to go. This right here actually looks really nice. The end, the little end cap, um, it's pretty good. The umbrella itself, like I said, it's like, you know, just a regular old umbrella. It says, it says Harry Potter right there. It's not like a dollar store or like a convenience store umbrella. It's definitely nicer feeling and looking than those. Um, but it still, I, I don't know if it's worth $60, you know? Like it's just, it's one of those things. It's like, man, 60 bucks. I think there are a lot other cooler 
things that you can get from Noble Collection that um, I would probably get before this, maybe even save up and get something bigger than this. Um, you know, you could get two wands for the price of this, basically. And uh, I'm a little let down. I do love that it comes in a uh, in a box. I think I may have forgotten this, but it does come in a beautiful, gigantic wand box. Um, and it doesn't have a label that, that says um, Hagrid's wand or Hagrid's umbrella on the side, like some of the, the wands to just have the, the character names on it. This is super like, look at this, come on now. And yes, you can display it in the box, but I just don't, I don't think it looks as good because of the um, these white things here and here. It's kind of weird. I may make an insert for it or something, um, or I may just uh, keep it in the box closed. I like to display the wands, so I like to keep them the way they are there, where they're open with the lid on the back and displaying the wand that way. Um, but with this, I don't know, I feel like I, I can't really do that. So now I pass it on to you guys. What do you think? Do you think you're gonna pick it up? Do you think that um, it's a cool thing that they did? I think it's cool that they made it. I just don't think it's worth the price. And I, uh, I think it's worth it for somebody that collects them like I do, or uh, some of you guys do. And uh, you know, if you have to have the collection, then you have to have the collection. It's just part of the, it's just part of the deal. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a comment down below letting me know that. And um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like the video if you liked it. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, bye, bye.